Alright, so now we're going to actually try uh, sample 36180, creating KPI dashboards using EG42. Um, I actually just got 4.2 uh, installed, so I'll need to go through every single aspect of this. Um, the first thing we'll do is move to downloads and download the DLL file. I would recommend saving the DIL file to the Enterprise Guide 4.2 root directory. Uh, that will ensure that it doesn't get uh, deleted by accident if you save it to your desktop or uh, to uh, your My Documents area. And now we're going to do Start Enterprise Guide. Add in, add in Manager, Browse, and select that DIL file I just downloaded. So now I have some uh, data that I would like to put in my KPI. I've got a sales target and actual and a budget target and budget actual. So then I'll go to Tools, Add-in, KPI Custom Add-in. And you'll see I've got the variables to assign and the task roles. So I'll just do um, the sales. And here I can select what type of KPI I'd like, whether it's a dial, a traffic light, a speedometer. I also have a lot of options as far as height, color, font, labels, and KPI values. You'll see now that we have the results. Um, we are currently in the yellow. What I can also do is uh, run the same add-in for the budget. And now I have that second dial here. It's a speedometer instead of a traffic light. So next what I'll want to do is add these two into a single report. So if I do File, New, Report, I can drop these contents here, move them around, and then select OK. And now you'll see I have two pieces of output in the same report. 